Hey everybody, here we go. This is the Michael Arrington, no lighting, no makeup, no nothing, no fillers, no tanning, bronzers, nothing, all natural. So um, in a couple of hours, I will be heading to the offices of Augustus Denton in Beverly Hills to have what's called the fractional CO2 laser resurfacing. And um, it's, they're basically gonna get rid of like it's I have so many acne scars from when I was a kid when I had really bad acne and you really can't see it but I have lots of stuff here I decided that they're gonna videotape it so I'm gonna get some of that footage and then we're going to um, uh, I'm going to every day I'm gonna let you see what I look like I, I you know I'm gonna like let you see the laser the swelling and everything and then we'll see the beginning and then the after and um, it's pretty pretty amazing so yeah a lot of people think I'm crazy but you know what I have the opportunity to get something I really can't afford and uh, at the same time I'm willing to let the world know hey I'm not embarrassed if I can if you can make yourself look better and it makes you feel good inside then damn it go for it so that's what I'm doing day number one here we go <laughs> See you guys soon. I'll see if I'm higher than a kite later. Maybe I'll do another video when I get back. Okay, send positive light. Bye. Hi, my name is August. I'm a nurse here in Beverly Hills, and we're about to do a cosmetic procedure on Michael. Um, the procedure is called fractionated CO2, and the purpose of it is for resurfacing the skin. So fine lines, wrinkles, and pores, a little bit of a scar in here. We can take all of that away and improve his self-esteem. Look 100%. So it's good to watch your patients and see if they have shaking or if they're punching the teeth or um, need that kind of break. So just a few minutes of a break can make such a difference. This is Michael after the treatment. You can see this little grid pattern is throughout the face, but there's no open wounds, there's no bleeding, um, just a moderate color change throughout, but that will worsen. Over the next couple days, you're going to get scabbiness. There's going to be redness. You might have um, areas where there's a little pinprick uh, bleeding. Mm -hmm. That's normal. Right. All right. And you're going to keep your face wet with Vaseline. <laughs> the Vaseline does two things. It provides a barrier on your face right. to prevent bacteria from getting on. Right. It also keeps things underneath wet, right. so skin it, grows better in moisture, Right. so that's the two things that it helps. Today the only thing you have to do is put Vaseline on in about an hour. Okay, that's so it. when I get home I throw the Vaseline mm -hmm. on. Yeah. And well, so when I sleep at night, get an old pillowcase because it's going to get gunky. Right. I had never had this type of treatment before, so I really didn't know what to expect. But I mean, a lot of people say horror stories, oh it's going to be whatever. Yeah, it's a little painful, um, I mean there's a burning sensation. But the thing is, is like right here in the T-zone of your face, that's where it hurt the most. But, you know, the hardest part was right in here. And, uh, but already, I mean, August showed me the, the, the mirror and I'm like, whoa. But I did a lot of research and I saw other people that had this process done. And, um, you know, I, I, I'm, I'm excited to see what this is going to look like in five or seven days. Yeah, every day it gets better, and the skin, the skin takes time to heal and turn over. So we see a progression of healing and a progression of tightening, scars softening, and we really can't even evaluate the final outcome till about three months out. Um, so this is one of these procedures you don't, you don't take lightly because it takes time to get through to the final result, and you can't do it every other weekend or something. This is maybe a once a year kind of treatment. Um, it's a, one of the big guns that we can use on the face. Uh, there's not a specific age for this treatment. If you're a younger teenager, you may have acne scars and you need treated. Consequently, if you're in your 70s and you have really lackluster um, crepiness of the skin, this is the treatment of choice for that because there's minimal downtime with maximal benefits to it. So they have, I don't know if you can see it, but it's amazing. You can see sort of like the, the laser stuff here, but you have to like completely cover your face in Vaseline. And then there's a vinegar, there's a vinegar thing, a vinegar wrap that you have to do with gauze starting tomorrow. But um, 
I guess the vinegar and water, you can call me a douchebag. <laughs> but anyway, this is, this is, I'll show you. Let me see if I can get up here any closer. All of this is amazing. All the lines under my eyes are gone. Literally evaporated. Um, they did under the neck here, which is covered in Vaseline. So what happens is with this particular laser, it uh, rebuilds the collagen and actually it's like getting a facelift. It will just pull you up. So here I am um, almost uh, two hours after the procedure and I am able to uh, talk to you. Well, good morning, everybody. It's day two. Do I look like a traffic accident victim or what? <laughs> yes, I am totally swollen. Um, I'm covered in Vaseline. I did the vinegar and water wrap this morning for 20 minutes. But, um, yep, this, this, this is day two. And I just got off the phone with Augustus Denton, who told me not to be alarmed. Even my dog won't come near me. Champagne is on the other side of the room. He's actually on, um, Lewis, who's, who's sleeping on the couch, who's visiting me. Good morning, everybody. Don't I look like a vision scab of loveliness? It's nice. See, my laser took place Wednesday afternoon at 3.30. It's Thursday, Friday, and now it's Saturday morning. The swelling has really gone down. Yesterday, I looked like I could have auditioned for a flower drum song as the lead. But my eyes are coming back, and now basically... they're. I know it looks like I've had it looks like I got a face mask on but um yeah I washed my hair this morning I was going crazy trying to get my I mean it was like ah I couldn't get my face wet but today I figured out how to lean over the tub and wash my hair so I feel much better but it 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 really all this dark brown stuff is the skin that is going to actually fall off I'm still shiny I'm still shiny and um, from stuff but here it is, basically day three. Hey everybody, it's morning number four since I had the Fraxel CO2 laser resurfacing. Most of the swelling has gone. And what you see right now is just redness. Um, the brown stuff is skin that is actually just gonna fall off. Woo, there we go. It's actually skin that's just gonna fall off but it is amazing i mean if you could see close up there are no more lines my lines are gone on my face um the, the little by little pieces of this stuff are falling off it's just kind of gross so if you're eating sorry but um the brown the darkest brown is the most damaged skin that I had and as I've explained before I had major acne scars what I can say is is that my skin is like tightening and um, um, it's not bad I mean I'm, I'm, I'm actually kind of shocked took a shower this morning washed the hair did the whole thing but um, it's 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 yes I look like I, I got scraped and whatever but no pain no nothing um, I can actually close up see all the improvements that are happening in my skin, especially around my lips. This area here, it is just amazing. Good morning, everybody. It's morning number five. Day five since I had the fractionated CO2 laser. Um, and there you have it. Look at this, I'm, I'm at the point of, of, there's still a little swelling because you know, hey, you just had major trauma to your face, but uh, a lot of the a lot of the dead skin is coming off. The brown splotches that you see are like this is where he had to go in heavy with the laser, um, heavy with the laser. But a lot of it, as you can see, is 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 gone. Hey, good morning, everybody. Day six. Yep, here it is. All of the skin has basically uh, fallen off. I am now um, using a Cetaphil cleanser and the Cetaphil uh, moisturizer. There's still some swelling. 
there's still healing going on because um, you know when you have your entire face lasered off you we're now going into what's called the sunburn effect it looks like I've been sunburnt but there's no more peeling of the skin um, now the collagen is rebuilding in the skin the suppleness and the everything will just start to fill out it's gonna be really really exciting so I'm kinda happy about it Hey everybody, guess what? Today is day number seven, exactly one week since I walked into August Denton Aesthetics in Beverly Hills and had my entire face and neck uh, lasered with the fractionated laser resurfacing. Just to let you know, I mean, I'm still red, even though the face, all the skin has fallen off. My best friends are Cetaphil moisturizer and Cetaphil uh, cleanser because they're very, very gentle and that's what you use on your face at this point. But um, I still have some redness, big time splotches, nothing really major right there. I took a, an electric sh razor and shaved close, but not all the way down to the skin because it was driving me crazy. I still want to like do a real shave with cream and a razor and I'll feel a lot better. But the thing is seven, seven days, one week, one week. This shows that you can go in, have it done and be back to work. It's really kind of cool. Hey everybody, guess what? Look at this, we're getting there, we're almost healed. So I'm going to my first uh, public event where I'm actually going out of the house and going to do something, you know, where there's lots of people. But um, yeah, I'm just a little red, it's healing. Hey everybody, guess what? Today is exactly two weeks since I had fractionated laser surgery on my face and my neck and um, I'm happy to say look at this I mean for those of you that have been following the videos you saw that after the fourth day I was actually able to like could go back to work if I worked in an office or something luckily I get to work from home but the thing is two weeks later look at this I have no makeup the only thing I have on my face right now is I wash my face with Cetaphil uh, soap and then did moisturizer that's it nothing but as you can see my face I, I was I saw my friend John Hall the other day and he thought I was wearing matte makeup and I said no this is it I mean I still have a little redness uh, in my skin but the fact is I have no more lines under my, my the lines under my eyes are gone my skin is totally smoothed out and um, my chin underneath here and through there is all tightened up. You can actually, I actually start to have my jaws line back again, which is pretty cool. But what I wanted to say is, it's like everyone that saw me went, wow, Michael, your skin looks incredibly better. And the wonderful thing about this is, is that for the next three to six months, the collagen and all the areas that were really, really bad will continue to improve because the collagen is building back into the skin. So, I mean, I can't go out in the sun, I have to wear sunscreen and stuff like that, but it works. 